This is the VOA Special English Health Report. A new campaign aims to fight 10 diseases that affect many of the world's poorest people, but do not get much attention. At the end of January, officials announced the London Declaration on Neglected Tropical Diseases. The diseases include conditions like sleeping sickness, guinea worm, and leprosy. They affect more than a billion people worldwide. The effort involves 13 drug companies and the governments of the United States, the United Kingdom, and the United Arab Emirates. It also includes the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, the World Bank, and health groups. The campaign promises almost $800 million for drug donation programs. Stephen O'Brien, a member of the British Parliament, was at the launch. He said financial investment and cumulative spending will increase five-fold from $79 million to $387 million by 2015. That is four treatments a second, he said. The United States Agency for International Development says neglected tropical diseases, or NTDs, cost governments and businesses $10 billion a year. This is in lost productivity and treatment costs. Dr. Donan Mubando is with the Tanzanian Ministry of Health and Social Welfare. He says the plight of people with the neglected tropical diseases is so real in my country, you need to see people with severe itching, lizard skin, which is a manifestation of river blindness. The declaration calls for control or elimination of the 10 diseases by 2020. Margaret Chan, the Director General of the World Health Organization said, just think of the prospect of freeing millions of people. Most of them are children and women so that they could have a healthy and productive life. The Gates Foundation is giving $363 million to the campaign. There have been many campaigns before against these diseases. Dr. Niraj Mistry of the Global Network for Neglected Tropical Diseases says, those earlier efforts were not very effective because access to drugs was limited. He says now, with the increased support, we can actually take the response to NTDs to scale, which means that we can treat more communities and more people. The 13 drug companies have also agreed to share information that could speed up the development of new treatments. For VOA Special English, I'm Mario Ritter. For more health news, along with activities for learning English, go to voaspecialenglish.com.